Welcome back, everybody, and it's time for us to rescue Z from the Lucra Hulk in this Jedi Survivor walkthrough. I don't know if it was thanks to us saying all of those crazy words, but the last couple of videos have been getting more views, so we're going to keep on going with that. If this video does help you, please leave me a like. I know it's annoying for us to have to keep reminding you, but it does help me out quite a bit on the channel. In any case, we've obviously moved quite far in terms of ground since the last video. All you need to do is fly back to Kobo, and then you can fast travel back to this meditation point up here. This is the devastated settlement, as you guys can see. Um, I figured you guys didn't need to see me going through like several low screens to get to here. You can just fast travel up this way. I literally have done nothing else. Um, and then we can continue with the mission as we go and rescue Z, as this walkthrough is going to be. I can't remember what this zone is called. We're going to be repeating the name of the zone once we get there. Many apologies. I know it's annoying. I don't like it myself, but that is what YouTube encourages because that is how we get more views. That's what I've got to do. So in any case, we're going to have to go on around. Oh, yeah, this is the one that I don't like. That's why this meditation point can be annoying because we've got to go all the way around to get back and over to the green door. We could go over that if we wanted. It's just like annoying, isn't it? Let's go and get it. You kind of have to float onto it and then jump back up. Then you can run back. There's going to be way worse ones later on. That's nice fine. Let's take this back to Z. But uh, play disc, I guess that's all right. Uh, it's up to you if you want to fight this for some extra XP. I guess I will actually. Just makes sense just to have that there. Means on the way. Then we can continue making our way forward. Dash through the shield, which is how we're actually getting to new zones now. Go through the squeeze. Feels like it's been a couple of days. I really need to go heavy on this today. So if you're watching this like as and when they go out, today may be a heavy day for, uh, oh, for releases is. for this. Let's get some photos. That's good, isn't it? You'll see Bode in a second. Got your mark. I'm coming in. Any sign of the droid? So just kind of wants us to scan some stuff. Could be a way in. It's the best option I can see. Only way to the Luker Hulk is through this swamp. For you, maybe. You want to ride, BD? When you're ready, make a move on. And that has everything all continue. There's not too much to find in the swamp, which is thankful because it's a bit of annoying to uh, to walk in because it is basically more tar. Make a way across. I'll try to keep my eyes out just in case I spot anything. I didn't spot on the initial stream through. Um, there's a chamber here, but I don't think we can do it yet until we get some new powers from the mission. So uh, this is actually going to unlock a lot of stuff directly after this mission. There is tons of stuff available. Some of it really powerful, such as perk slots um, and all sorts of other things. I don't know whether or not it is a good opportunity for me to do like some kind of clean up building, thing because we are still missing powers after this here. so it's a bit or did once. a bit weird um you can't see from here but there's actually an underpart to this um Time little island we're now on so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna collect some stuff how much do you think this is worth and i don't Nothing's think we can get rings. to because over this way there is a meditation point i don't think we can get there yet it's too far away um you'll see when we go over Let's check this place out if we look down, look, we can't, can't move these yet. We can get the loot, though. We can get that. What's this zone called now? This is the Viscid Bog. Although, I don't think this is technically the Viscid Bog walkthrough. That should, in theory, be after, because that's when we're going to be going over that way. There's an annoying boss fight. Can we see it from here? It's there. I think it's there. We got a pretty tough enemy guarding a stem, so get the dialogue with these done so they move on. Okay, got another uh, bit of BS out of those two. I, feel, I hate their dialogue. I don't know why. They just really annoy me. They great grated on me in the stream. I was like, oh god, can you just hurry up? Uh, so underneath us is the way forward, I believe. Where are we? Oh, no, might just be looped. We gotta go under anyway. Right, so where are we? Right here. Is it here? Nope. Let me find it. Come on. 
I'm gonna I'm gonna go the way I went on the stream then. It looked like there was an easy way when I went through this way, but uh, I ended up kind of going in a backwards way. So we're gonna do that. Go over here. Just see, there's a cave, so I'm gonna like double jump and I'm gonna dash. I don't think we're supposed to come this way. I'm sure there's like a better entrance, but it works for me. Gotta make sure we get all the loot. I don't think there's anything over here. Yeah, <laughs> see, you're supposed to come from that way. Look, I can't move that. And get the scan. There's no other way up but to the I think either. coming off that other end is better. I should have gone with that, but I just wanted to make sure I covered all the bases. So, hopefully, you guys are enjoying my Jedi Survivor walkthrough as we zip line our way up here. We're gonna do some climbing so that we can continue the rescuing of Z mission. You ever been in a Jedi Survivor? Before, buddy? Been a long time for me. I'm not looking for. I wonder if it'll get the right in the closed captions when YouTube processes them. Make sure it says Z. Lots of E. Right, this way. Jump across. That way we can continue to rescue Z in Jedi Survivor. And we're going to do a Jedi Survivor jump over this way. <laughs> and I'm making myself laugh because it sounds absurd. But if this is what's going to work, it's what's going to work, isn't it? Bam! Nick, get up. Don't knock me off, that would be bad. Did I change the difficulty? I must have done. There's no way it should be that right. Let me change this because that's going to look really bad. Must have uh, got myself stuff. Yeah, right, there we go. Sometimes I like to go and get just a couple of extra skill points because I know things are coming. Um, and a tip right now. Um is make sure you have some practice with the single lightsaber because there's going to be a point where we have no choice but to fight with one it's the worst fight in the game and i assume people are going to get stuck there i'm still working out exactly the best way to deal with it is without turning down the difficult that's not what i want to suggest to people but if that's what it takes for me to suggest to people, that's what I'm going to suggest. Um, there's a fight that's kind of, I don't, I don't want to say unfair, but anyway, this played Elden Ring, uh, this boss has beat me more times than, Mille than Millennia has. And we're talking, I've only played through this game once, and I've played through Elden Ring five times, and this boss has beat me more times than Millennia in total. Which just screams PPS to me. And that's not normal. I feel sorry for people that are like being um, like quite sto stoic and going on like Jedi Master or something. Like, <laughs> it's going to be painful when they get there. I might even watch someone do it. <laughs> Better than me. Like, right, come here. Excuse me, I'm the one that parries. Such a warm welcome. I guess knocking isn't an option. Oh, we'll find our own way. Do you smell that too, BD? <laughs> Think you can break that coupling? Let's find out. That's gonna be struck up later. I thought there was a meditation point right here. Yes, not. When in doubt. Now have it. Now we can continue moving. Excuse me, get off. Oh, it wasn't that nice. These get really tough later on. I don't know why there was so much tougher on the street. Solid teamwork. Okay. Uh 
Is that progression up there? Yes. Check the other end of the boat. Keep my eyes out as we're going around. I can hear my dog snoring. Hopefully that's not going down the microphone. <laughs> Short goatee. I don't know. I think stubble suits him the best. The initial um, facial hair. The rest of it just looks silly. I, th I feel like a lot of the optional cosmetics look silly yeah. on his face. She thinks Tantalor could really help the path. All right. Well, you do seem happier now that she's around. Okay, let's focus. C needs us. This piece of junk could sink any second. Nah, she'll hold. Just wait till you see what's inside. Yeah. So what is this area that I'm in still called? Loading gantry. Yeah, so it has changed from viscous bog. Viscous bog. Oh no, it is still viscid bog. Bog, it says it's up left. Okay, so this is a viscid bog walkthrough, in fact. I have to make sure that I say that. Um, So here we're going to do a swing onto that bit over there. I love the way they make you zip through so much of these areas. You end up going round and round. Whoops. It's craziness. So if you haven't already and you're enjoying the Jedi Survivor walkthrough, please leave me a like and subscribe to the channel. It tells YouTube that I'm doing an okay job. Could you clear this up? In addition, I have to make sure that I'm asking because um, there seems to be a group of people, and I don't know exactly who, how many, or why, but every time I upload a video, within the first five minutes, there's an immediate three dislikes in the first three views, um, and I don't know what's causing that. So if you guys can help me out and try and fight some of that off, that'd be great. It'd be nice to actually, you know, have them in um, over 50% like ratio, because I really don't usually get that many likes, because I don't ask. Or maybe I'm just not very good, but you guys aren't telling me that, so... Whoa, excuse me. Why was it not running there? Just a bit of a uh, <laughs> button issue there, apparently. This is also a good mission to be using um, Bode to get some of the kills. I believe it's 10 we need to get, but we definitely need to get a certain amount so that um, we can rock a, rock a trophy or achievement. It happens more than you think. Alright, let's go. Clear. And we keep on moving. Uh, the boss fight here is actually very good. I enjoyed this boss fight in this zone. Miss me, BD? Rest at Mentation Point. We're on 13 minutes. Damn! I feel like I've wasted so much time. Just look at this place. I thought I'd saved us some as well. Have a nice nap. Place is quite long. <laughs> nice also, nap. Not a nap. Cheeky sod. Uh, that way. Yeah, it's just like oh, it's all fuzzy now. <laughs> Came from that way. No, don't go there. Yeah, I'm going to say it's through the door. That's what we're going with. There we go. Ahead, I'm you got me! I'll get you again in a minute. I'll get you hard enough though, didn't I? Yeah, these are the troublesome ones. With the... With the the pince or whatever it is that can grab you. Oh, finish that off. There we go. Like, it, the, the encounters start getting a bit crazy with all these different enemies, like, constantly, like, staggering you and stuff. Particularly, like, the commando droids that are actually quite quite tough. You could be deep. Keep going up, yeah? Oops. There. Never doubt it. 
Keep going. I'll scout around. I'm sure there are no surprises. Be careful. Another into the Lucre Hulk. Yes, that's right. Well, I suppose we're in the Lucre Hulk now, though, so it's no longer the Viscid Bog. Mm. What am I to do with this? I suppose it can do this the same as the. Uh, with the forest array. This is like the entrance, right? And the next one will be like the continuation. Jump around. Jump around. Cross to there. And then we can run up this way. Come on. Oh man, really. I know I was supposed to time it. It's just like... I was just at the wrong position. Trying to be smooth. Did I survive a walkthrough? Is not as smooth as some. I'm sure. Make a way over. Man. It's not like I can just stay still. What? Let me through. <laughs> Let me through there. It can all be a bit crazy, as you can see. I don't, I don't know what I'm supposed to say, because it's like, it's really fast. So in terms of like trying to get speech out as a walkthrough, like jump, dash, jump, dash, clap. I, I don't know if I can do that in this uh, Jedi Survivor walkthrough. You guys let me know. Uh, why can't I see where I'm supposed to go? It's always the roof ones to catch you out. That's what I say. Where are they going? Is the force just like destiny or something? It's like, <laughs> ah, look, we're going to a dead end. Oh no! Something just happened to vibrate down. Shortcut unlocked, which is lovely. Have a heal. Faced one of these before. This should not be. Too much of an issue. No submission for you. Amazing. I love that. Oh, no, the door don't work. So, as you saw, we just kind of uh, left trigger pulled that off. And now we have access to the pull point, which allows us to continue the rescuing of Z walkthrough in the Luca Hulk that's actually a part of the Viscid Bog, as far as we're concerned. That's really hard to say. Viscid Bog. Anyways, we're going to jump across. Um, so it's kind of like an annoying bit here. So as we go across, if you drop off this too early and those dudes down there spot you, and then obviously you kind of get reset back to here, they remain aggroed, which can make it a bit difficult to get across. So we've got to be a bit careful as we make our way over in a second. Just having a quick sip of juice, I'm sorry. Stay alert. We have reports of hostiles in the area. So here we have to drop and then immediately double jump forward as you can see so we've got to drop off double forward and then we're in here and now we can decide who we want to assassinate and i actually find the, the raiders to be the biggest trouble so we're going to take care of you first it's hilarious Let's get you down, will be. Because that those bots are like programmed to dodge the return fire from their own bullets. Is that how bad the Jedi are? Is it? Uh, these white shields we can't go through. We have to go through green ones. Games decided that you know <laughs> we needed different coloured shield. Kind of funny. Uh, there's not actually that many of the white ones though, so I suppose it's not that bad. Knock that down. That'll be a shortcut back. So if you are particularly bad off, and I suppose there's no real reason not to rest right now, so let's do that. We don't have to fight any enemies to get back to where we were. Need to center myself. So let's encourage everybody to do the right thing. And with 19 minutes, that's actually perfect in terms of. Um, the end of this episode of the Jedi Survivor walkthrough. Previously, I'm just looking at that, and we're not going to get the item that we need to 
access that up there for a little while. So there's going to be reasons to come back here. That's obviously going to be loot up there that I haven't gotten before. I do have access to that in our streams, though. So yes, uh, cleanup in every zone is going to be a thing. So if you do miss a couple of items, just don't worry about it. You're going to get a map and you're going to get access to it all. Either way, that is the end of this Jedi Survivor walkthrough episode. I hope you guys will join me soon for the next one.